Hey everybody, Matt here. Just a real short video today. I want to show you how I make real simple tables for my workshop. So basically I make a 2x4 frame to support the top. I use 2x4s for the legs. I will rip a 2x4 in half to make uh, nominal 2x2 pieces to be used as the stretchers between the legs. And then I'll also add leveling feed to all four legs. Turning the table over, you can see the frame of 2x4s that I made to support the top. Now this table generally holds my table saw, and there's four mounting bolts that hold the table saw to the table. There's two mounting holes right there, and there's two more mounting holes over here. That's why this 2x4 is moved that way on the other side of these legs to give me the ability to get two mounting bolts through the plywood top to hold down the table saw on this side and then the other two mounting bolts, mounting bolts the holes are free of any of the 2x4s so there's no conflict. Legs are just screwed and glued with using drywall screws to the top frame. Stretchers, same thing. And then my leveling feet. So I hope you can see that the construction of this table is very, very simple. You don't need any special tools. You could use a hand saw or maybe a circular saw to cut the 2x4s. You could use a drill to drill the holes and drive the screws. I just used drywall screws. You could use a carpenter square to try and keep the, the table as square as you can when you assemble it. And that's about it. This table is for my table saw. I built another table that's a little bit longer but very similar in construction for my sliding miter saw and I built a third table same construction again for my benchtop drill press. All three of these tables have stood up pretty well over the last couple of years. I don't have any complaints, concerns, or issues. If I was to build another table today I would probably build it just like this one. So that's how well they've worked out for me. Bye.